to go and give shout outs to Kickstarter and Indiegogo campaigns. In fact, I actually reached out to a few companies asking whether I could get exclusive access to some of their products before they even got funded. Now, that's kind of tough since obviously these are all in the beta stages, but sometimes products are completed fully and then they are funded. And in this case, that's the case. So of course, people really love this and while their original goal was 40,000, people loved it so much, they are almost at 200,000. Now of course, that gives them a lot of leeway to of course market the product and so they decided to sponsor me. I hope they go ahead and make enough of these so everyone who actually asked for one of these will be able to get their hands on it. So as you guys can see, if you want to fund it, go for it. $120, you get buy two, get one free. $5, thank you. $10, add an engraving to your top lock. Pretty cool. Um, it, I mean, if it was engraving, I'd probably say this stuff belongs to smart tech don't touch it and 39 in fact that should be a feature like you should be able to put like your name on the lock that way anyone who goes and goes what the heck is this bag lying here or say you lose your bag they'll easily be able to return it just by looking at the lock that's actually a pretty cool feature if they did that now 39 dollars early bird um you get the tap lock light i actually love that price that's pretty awesome tap lock light right here 46 dollars plus shipping um tap lock light is designed with travelers in mind but it's not just for travelers if you need to lock your belongings at the gym lightweight water resistant and secure pretty cool pretty cool this one is sold out all right then we got 66 we got 109 120 135 145 also sold out you get two of the tap locks and you get two tap lock lights i'm actually going to explain what all those are in a second 170 475 1000 3000 it just keeps going all the way up to 10,000. pretty cool right Okay, so now we're going to get to the actual video. How exactly does it work? So basically, you sync this with your phone. You basically scan your fingerprint on this tiny little lock right here. And afterwards, only your fingerprint will be able to unlock this. Unless you go into the app and add more. Now, this isn't exactly uh, just convenient for something you'll just leave at home. We've already seen doorknobs and things that can do this. But what if you could take your lock anywhere, right? So, of course, that's their whole idea. They think that if you bring your bags to the gym or say you have to lock a locker at school or something along those lines and in that case you don't necessarily trust a code because anyone can look over your shoulder and just be able to use that code all of a sudden all your things aren't really that secure uh, so the best way to prevent this is just to add a fingerprint that way only you and you only can unlock this now they decide to add a really cool feature i was like you know what okay i'm tempted to buy this but i feel like other people are going to make the same thing and eventually it'll probably get cheaper but then they were like you know what we're going to make it really tempting so you get to charge this thing using your phone, and guess what? This thing can actually charge your phone. That's right, say your phone runs out of battery, well, all of a sudden you can use this, use a little uh, plug it into the bottom of this, there's a little USB input, and you'll be able to charge your phone. I think the main reason they did this is because, say you have to unlock your little lock, and, I don't know, you want to mess around with the actual application in here. Well, in that case, you kind of need your phone no matter what, so in that case, you don't ever have to worry about that. They also designed it to be super durable, so if you're going to be locking something super valuable, say your actual motorcycle, or say you have a garage or something, you'll be able to use this and it's set to go. Of course, it's really durable outside since, once again, it's waterproof. So they really did think of everything, every way you can possibly innovate a lock. And as you guys can see, there's a cool little battery, the fingerprint sensor, it's all there, so they're not messing around with anything, they've made everything, they know how these things work, and they're pretty much the first ones to do it, or at least the first ones to do it right, and I actually really respect that. Now here's a look at some of the things that they sent me to take a look at, here's a little exclusive previews for you guys. So as you guys can see, the available colors for the actual tap locks are going to be black, white, gray, silver, and of course pink. Uh, I think I'm going to get my hands on that pink one. Actually, they told me they would send me two of these soon enough, so that'll be pretty cool as soon as it comes out. And I'll actually get to review it and tell you guys like how fast the fingerprint sensor works, apparently really fast, and whether or not it really is a convenience, how heavy it is, and things along those lines. That, Those things I can't really test right now. Tap lock light, of course, comes in black and White, so that's pretty cool. I'm um, taking a look at some of the other things over here. We got ourselves the way that you can charge your phone with this. As you guys can see, the phone is actually charging. All right, this is it, just looks slick. Here's a look at some of the three colors and really interesting way of putting these up. That's like a design thing. As a look at the app, which personally, right now, I feel like their app needs a little bit of work, but if it's convenient and easy to use, I'll be happy to go with it. 
here's another look at the waterproof uh, waterproofing on this lock pretty cool uh, any other things that's relevant here's just a list of some of the main features of course fingerprint access I like the simplicity there's no extra buttons on here there's no like key input there's no code input nothing along those lines you just you just tap it it's just as simple as touch ID portable phone charger high security Bluetooth access access sharing and water resistance I guess it really is cool I mean if you think about it why lug around a battery pack when you can lug around your backpack with a lock on it it's perfect the idea is brilliant so if you guys want to go ahead and fund it go for it if not that's and you just want to purchase it when it comes out go for it it's all up to you guys hopefully you enjoyed this video if so leave a like and don't forget to subscribe i look forward to testing this when it does come out and thank you guys for watching this is going to be me logging off